Hey, let's get right into it. Tuesday after a long three day, actually we had four days with the BAM quality time. Back into it now though before the rain comes down. How do you help kids understand how to get what they want in a positive way, right? Because they can whine and cry about it like they were when they were two and get what they want. But eventually, you know, that, that doesn't tend to go over very well in the workplace. You know, imagine 20 years down the road. Although you still see some people, I guess, whining and crying, trying to get their way. But, uh, you know, positive ways. How do you do that? How do you do that? Well, one, I think, is you need to make the connection between effort and achievement or attainment. Okay? Because if you're not working hard, and by working hard, I'm talking about uh, willing to put in the effort needed to achieve something, Hey, you're not going to get a whole lot. You're just not going to be able to achieve a lot, especially today. Today with the economy and just the way the world is, the good news is is that folks that are willing to put in the effort, that are really wanting to get somewhere, are able to do that. Because right? the competition is kind of slimmed down. We still have a bunch of the whiners out there. They're still thinking they're going to get what they want by whining and crying about it. How can you help as a parent biggest way to do this encourage the pursuit of a passion middle school is a wonderful time because kids now are very emotional yeah that's a good thing right they can get passionate about something in their life that they feel like is really important to them and then you have to encourage that passion by exposing them to opportunities that will give them um, positive ways of really getting somewhere being able to achieve something and they're going to be willing to put in the effort because it's something that they really want in their lives right now. Uh, the other big one, though, is that you as a parent, you have to decide on what is it that you're most passionate about. And then show them that. Talk about it with them. Talk about how you're struggling. And the reason that you're struggling is because you really want this, whatever this is, your career. Maybe you're writing a book. That's a long road, by the way, but well worth it. Um, Whatever it is, maybe volunteering is your thing, or philanthropy. Show them what it means to really stay committed to something, to put in the effort, but then also show them what's at the end. Kids have a hard time understanding where the effort is leading. Well, you know, what do I get from this? So show them what it is that you've achieved and attained and make that connection between effort and achievement so that when they do grow, into something, whether it's a career or whatever it is that they're doing when they leave your home, that they understand that if they're willing to put in real effort to get what they want, that they'll be able to achieve that. They really will be able to get what they want. But the connection between effort and achievement, number one. All right. Hey, today is episode number 99, show number 100. Big milestone coming up tomorrow. Talk to you then. Bye-bye.